Hey, Becca C. Smith here, and it is Monday. <laughs> okay, I did save all of my thread throughs for today, but I think what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to write some of the things that I want to weave in as a separate document because some of it is, I don't want it to just be exposition and just, hey, just so you know, you know, kind of what I called world building puke. <laughs> I, I do that sometimes. I do that a lot. I mean, everyone does it to a certain degree. I try to fix it in the editing process, but obviously some of it still gets through. But if I am conscious of it and aware of it, I'm, luckily I have good CPs and betas for that. But again, with a huge world building world, sometimes it happens. But I don't want that to happen with this particular thread through arc. I want it to be present. I want it to be action. I want it to feel visceral. Let's pull a card and then I will get started. Obviously I just got out of the shower. I already did my workout today so I'm feeling good and uh, it's still it's still morning. It's like 10 a.m. I think so I'm, I'm, I'm off to a good start today at least psychologically <laughs> and physically. Okay the porcupine trust your process and yourself that's funny that i get this like right after i just said that honor your connection to the great mystery and have faith oh my god okay that's crazy that i got this right after that speech about doing this whole new process okay i'm gonna trust it the porcupine says to trust this process so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna leave them out so i can see them all right I'm gonna get started. I was working standing just so I wouldn't be sitting all day and then I decided okay I've been standing for an hour so I think I'm gonna sit now and I turn around and look who's on my seat. <laughs> That's alright I should probably keep standing. <laughs> it's better for me. It is almost three o'clock and I still haven't started anything. I ended up doing a bunch of errands and oh shocker. He heard me vlogging. Yeah, so I don't know, man. It's been a rough day. I think it might be more of an evening work, but maybe not, I don't know. I have done some marketing stuff. I've done some, like I said, errands. I did grocery shopping. I did, I did a lot of stuff. <laughs> anyway, I don't know why I'm not feeling it today. I guess because I know that these thread throughs are, I should just do it. All right, well, I gotta call my mom. I'm gonna walk for 40 minutes, so maybe that'll clear my head. And then, hopefully, I'm gonna get back to it. We shall see. It's Tuesday. <laughs> okay, I just exercised and showered. It's still early, it's 10.30, even though yesterday I felt like that was a great start. <laughs> I, where I left you, I did end up working a little bit. I think the reason why I had such a hiccup is because um, I really want this particular thread through to not feel completely out of place. I want it to, I want it to be a whole vibe unto itself. I know that makes it sound like it should be out of place, but I wanted to weave in, but also have its own kind of vibe. I did get some words in. I'm staring at them right now on my computer, and, and I like the direction it's going. So it's going to be another day of writing these little snippets that I will then thread through and then do the rest of the thread through stuff, which isn't that much. So I do think I'll be able to finish today, even though, as I've said in my other vlogs, two day, Tuesdays are marketing days. Elk. Persistence brings rewards. <laughs> Support your health and stamina. Honor your ability to endure. Wow, okay. You know what? That's kind of perfect. I, I already supported my health and stamina by exercising, so I feel like I already ticked one off the list. So now I just have to do persistence. Persistence brings rewards because I just need to get through it and I need to honor my ability to endure because this is a lot of editing. What are we in week six now? And you know, I was editing way before that. <laughs> I feel like I've been, that's just since I started vlogging, right? I've been editing this thing for months before that. So yeah, 
I'm gonna, it's gonna feel really good to give it to those betas and CPs. All right, well, I wrote this first scene and I really like it. So I just have to figure out where to put it. And then the follow-ups, I think, I think I might write like maybe one or two follow-ups to reiterate this point. And then the rest, if I'm threading it through, to do it as I go. And then there's only one other thing that I need to add. And that one, I might just be able to add without actually writing a separate scene. So I could be finished with this today. Ah, and I already did my marketing session with Hina and I did five reels. So those are ready to go this week and she did four so we have way too many, which is great. That's better to have too many than too little. <laughs> so far so good, much better than yesterday. Man, I was in a funk yesterday. <laughs> Still managed to write yesterday, so I guess that's good. Like even being in such a funk, I was still able to do things, not just write, but also some other things. So but I'm feeling like I'm on track again. If I can thread these things through today, then the next three days, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I can read through it. Crossing fingers. Okay, I'm gonna get back to it. It is Wednesday. Yay. I did end up writing the scenes and I did thread most of them through. So I'm gonna finish up threading them through this morning and then I am reading through the whole thing. So I'm hoping to do that these next three days, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, so that I can meet my goal of October 1st where I send it to everyone. Honestly, at this point, just because I've sat with this for so long, it's gonna feel really good. Like sometimes I get nervous when I send out a manuscript. I mean, everybody does to a certain extent. You want people to like it. And I still have all those innate, <laughs> normal uh, fears of just like, oh God, I hope they like it. But honestly, I don't, I, I've just read it so many times that I need a break. I need a break from this draft. It'll feel really good to send it on October 1st because it's that feeling of like, it's out of my hands now. It's out of my hands. <laughs> I don't have to think about it. I have to think about book two, but I don't have to think about book one right now. <laughs> so I am gonna finish these thread throughs and then I'm gonna start reading. I don't know why I'm procrastinating today. I, you know, it's actually kind of fun because they're new chapters that I'm gonna be reading. So it's not like I have to read the same chapters over and over again like I normally do. At least the first half are um, a lot of new, brand new chapters. So I just gotta get into it. But I got distracted because I got an email from NaNoWriMo, which I'm gonna do this year and I may or may not have bought myself a mug and a sweatshirt. <laughs> I'm committing this year, I'm committing. I'll definitely be doing a nano video in October for Preptober of what I'm going to be doing, but I was looking at the community because I was realizing that this is the first nano that I won't be in Los Angeles and so I'm kind of bummed because I love seeing my Nano LA, but this year I'm gonna be in Toronto, so I've got to, I don't have to change it, but I think it might be fun to change it to Toronto. Anyway, look how pretty that is. Nano LA, Nano LA. That's distracting, so I probably should get back to reading. I got three days to read through this so I can send it off to CPs and betas. Why am I not finding any motivation? All I wanna do is like prep and outline and <laughs> I wanna do all that stuff. I'm tired of editing. I'm so tired of editing. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, so I didn't follow up last night, but I did a lot of reading. I'm getting through these new chapters and I think they're working. I don't know if I'm too close to it or not. I guess that's what CPs and betas are for, but I'm crossing fingers. I haven't got through them all yet, but I'm, I'm really liking it so far. I think, yes. I'm so terrified. It's so weird. It's like I never like anything that I write, but I'm thinking I like this. I have no confidence in myself. This is a problem. This has been a problem my entire life. Zero confidence. <laughs> imposter syndrome. The definition of imposter syndrome. You see my face right there. <laughs> But uh, I'm having fun. I am reading it through and making little changes here and there, threading through the little stuff that I didn't need to do with the big stuff. And yeah, I'm gonna try and crank through as much as I can today. So it's nine o'clock. Yesterday, which worked really well for me, is that I exercised at night. So it gave me the whole day to work. So I'm going to do the same thing today. Yeah, so it's 9 a.m. I'm gonna get to it. I've been standing for two hours because I just don't have the heart to take him off the chair. <laughs> so sweet, because I'm standing right here and then he's just right behind me. I was like, oh, it's probably better for me to stand anyway, but he's so cute. I'm very excited because Kate is doing one hour sprints, yay! <laughs> so that's perfect I've been reading through and editing all morning and early afternoon I took a little bit of break for lunch and then her stream started yay so uh, it's already started so I should probably get going but yes so she's gonna be doing two one-hour sprints and I will be joining her and everyone else for those as well and let's see how far I can get Five thirty. I gotta exercise. I gotta eat. I gotta eat dinner. I gotta digest. Then I gotta exercise. My brain is fried. I've been working all day, and I'm on page one hundred and forty out of four hundred and seventeen. <laughs> so I don't think I'm gonna finish tomorrow, and that's okay. I am editing these chapters that I've never read before, so of course they're gonna take longer. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna make dinner. <laughs> Friday. I've actually been on StreamYard all morning because I have been brainstorming an idea, a screenplay idea actually, with one of my very best friends in the entire universe, Marnie. And we just wrote a pilot last January. It's the one that we entered into some contests. We did place, by the way. Yay, your placement. I'll do a whole video on all the contests that I placed in because they're all pretty much I've gotten as far as I could get in all the ones that I entered. But we are probably going to be trying to find a manager together, we're thinking, because we really like writing together. And we want to have a full feature screenplay to have ready to go. So that's what we're working on. And I'm really excited about this idea. It's still not completely fleshed out, but it's getting there. But in order to concentrate on these things, I need to finish this draft of The Severed and The Hunted. So I am going to hop to it. It's already noon. I hope I can finish today, but it's looking like it's gonna spill into next week. We shall see. I'm hoping that it goes super fast after I get through my new chapters, but you never know. All right, I'm gonna get to it. Hello, oh, it is Saturday. <laughs> normally I don't vlog on Saturday. Actually, normally I don't even work on Saturday, but I really, 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 really wanted to finish this draft so I could send it out to people and so that they would have it for all of October and all of November, which I know are, for writers, the worst time of year to ask somebody to beta or CP for you. 
Uh, luckily, half of the people I'm asking have, don't even know what Nano is and never pay attention to it, so that's good. But the other half, uh, I don't know if they're doing Nano this year, so hopefully two months is enough. We shall see. But I finished! I should have started with that. Um, <laughs> I finished. I thought it would take me the whole weekend, but it only took me, uh, only took me, it took me pretty much the whole day today, but it is done. I have sent it out and I am so <sighs> relieved. <laughs> Obviously, I'm still going to have to do a ton of edits when I get all the notes back and I, this isn't even, I haven't even done line edits and grammar and things like that, but I'll have the whole month of December to do that, and that's the only thing I'm going to be doing in December, so I have full confidence that I will be able to get it perfect, so then I can hand it off to Enchanted Ink Publishing and the editor, and then I will have a book! Okay, I am going to take it easy for the rest of the day. Um, although I did buy Natalia Lee's Preptober workbook and I put in the order this morning at Staples. So supposedly they do it all in one day. So I may be walking down to Staples later on today to pick up my workbook. And that means next week I can fully dive into Preptober. This is literally my favorite time of year, like hands down. October, November, Preptober, Nano. I just, I am, even when I don't even accomplish Nanos, it's still my favorite time of year. <laughs> I just get so excited. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining and let me know how you guys did this week in the comments and I will see you next week. <laughs>